So you are done recording your song, your vocals are sounding good, but when it comes to the mixing stage, it feels like the vocal sounds too thin. One thing most people mess up when it comes to mixing vocals is EQ. Many people don't know for some reason, they don't know how to use vocal EQ and it's one of the simplest tools you can use to get great results. Now you have to listen to the context of the song and the artist. Hey, oh yeah. If you send me the location, then I'll be right there. Then make a check on you, my baby. No time, no. And my dog is a probation. Now, after listening to the song, it's important to take note of the issues you hear first before you start making any decision. From what I can hear in the vocal, there's a lot of bass in the vocal and the vocal is not so bright. The vocal sounds dark. All right, so when I come right here, I'm going to do a high pass. Come, come right here and I'm going to make it to a 96 dB, okay? Now, I'm going to sweep it gently across between 80 to 150 hertz and see where the vocal sounds natural. Whenever I notice that it's sounding unnatural, I'm going to back off a little bit. If you send me the location, then I'll be right there. Then make a check on you, my baby. No type, no. And my dog is a probation. Another five years. Bring girls to his location. If you send me the location, then I'll be right there. Then make a check on you, my baby. No type, no. And my dog is a probation. Another five years. Bring girls to his location. If you send me the location, then I'll be right there. Then make a check on you, my baby. No type, no. And my dog is a probation. Now we fixed that point, that low end. Next, we're going to fix is the mids. I'm going to bring this right here. Again, we're going to find resonance. No type, no. Your body fire. If you send me the location, then I'll be right there. Then make a check on you, my baby. No type, no. And my dog is a probation. Another five years. Bring girls to his location. No time. If you send me the location, then I'll be right there. And make a check on you, my baby. No time, no. And my dog is a probation. Another five years. Bring girls to his location. No time. If you send me the location, then I'll be right there. And make a check on you, my baby. No type, no. And my dog is a probation. Another five years. Bring girls to his location. No type, no. Your body fire. If you send me the location, then I'll be right there. Then make a check on you, my baby. No type, no. And my dog is a probation. Another five years. Bring girls to his location. No type, no. Your body fire, go. The next, I'm going to boost the high end a little bit just so that I have some brightness, some spark in the vocals. If you send me the location, then I'll be right there. Then make a check on you, my baby. No type, no. And my dog is a probation. Another five years. Bring girls to his location. No type, no. Your body fire, go. So tip number one is to get your vocal IQ right because that's the genesis of your problems when it comes to mixing vocals. Now the next thing you can do is use an EQ on your beats. So let's load up this EQ right here. Now if your vocals still sound like it's buried in the beat, especially if you're not the one that mixed the beat, you can load up an EQ on your beat and then create space for your vocals. For example, I can take out some high end which will make the vocals sound a bit more present. If you send me the location. Then I'll be right there Then make a check on you, my baby No type, no And my dog is a probation Another five years Bring girls to his location No type, no Your body fire, go You can also come to the mids and take out some frequencies as well Again, we're going to pinch a little bit and create a slight dip right here Somewhere around typically between 600 to um, 2K, somewhere around in that region, depending on where your voice is struggling to shine. So, if you send me the location, then I'll be right there. Then make a check on you, my baby. No type, no. And my dog is a probation. Another five years. Bring girls to his location. No type, no. Your body fire, go. Oh, baby, why not draw? If I turn off the EQ, if you 
you send me the location Then I'll be right there And make a check on you, my baby No time, no Can I turn it on? Easily, you can already hear, you know, the space being carved out of the beats for the vocals. So the third thing you can try is adding saturation or exciters to your vocals. So right here, I have this free plugin from Slate Digital called Fresh Air. All I have to do is adjust the mid air. You can adjust the high air, but that boosts the higher frequencies, but the mid air boosts more of the mid range. So let's exaggerate this how you hear it sound. So this how it sounds when the infant is not engaged. If you send me the location, then I'll be right there and make a check on you, my baby. And then this is what happens when I boost the high mids. If you send me the location, then I'll be right there. And make a check on you, my baby. No type, no. And my dog is a probation. And under five years, bring your source location. No type, no. Now you can hear how much presence this plugin added to the vocals. Now you don't have to boost it this much. You have to do it in context to your own mix. Okay, just simply adjust till it sounds present and you know decent in your mix. You can also add a little bit of sparkle if you want, but you have to be careful with adding too much high frequencies. Again, that's what makes your vocal sound papery, thin, and harsh. So I'm not going to advise you to do too much here. If you send me the location, then I'll be right there and make a check on you, my baby. No type, no. My dog is a probation And under five years Bring girls to his location No type, no Your body fire go Oh baby, why not go Another thing you can do is use parallel compression on your vocals So I'm going to come right here to the vocal presets By the way, all of these um, chains I'm using right now is from the vocal mixing preset You can get it, the link is in the description Or you can visit the website tutorials.com so let's come to descend parallel compression let's use premium stock also works but let's use premium so it's it's just basically an la76 that i see la76 and then a saturation plugin just to add that extra grit to it okay so all you have to do is just send your vocals in here and then you mash it up with this fader okay you mash it up to blend that's just simply how parallel compression works okay so i don't want it to be too loud instead it wants to be Present enough in the mix, so this is when it's not engaged at all. If you send me the location, then I'll be right there. Then this is how it sounds when I start when I mix it up a little bit by increasing this. If you send me the location, then I'll be right there and make a check on you, my baby. No type, no. And my dog is a probation. And under five years, bring girls to his location. When I turn it off, if you send me the location, then I'll be right there and make a check on you, my baby. No type, no. So the last but not the least tip I'll give you, which is a very helpful tip, is to use doubles. Like in this session right here, this is the main lead vocal and this is the double for it the double is just a slight variation of the main vocal so that it has the illusion of width and also thickness so this is how the main vocal sounds now the lady says she know only me oh my jay say my lamba no ne puta oh no waje moving very bad 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 yes you know moving very bad 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 yes you know dinner dvd dvd propagate i and this is how it sounds with the double now the lady says she know only me oh my jay say my lamba no ne puta oh no waje moving very bad 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 yes you know moving very bad 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 yes you know then I divvy divvy deep up I hit the volume making you jam me through the night shake it sloppy sloppy cause I will chop it tonight by the way this is why I hearing a lot of breath in here is because this is this was a recording session not a mixing session and this was done with the vocal mixing preset so you just drag and drop and quickly we're able to get something really good that kind of sounds like a polished mix but it's not a polished mix so if you again if you want to get the presets link is in the description if you found these tips helpful don't forget to like and subscribe for more tutorials tips and tricks